Local 4 News starts now with a breaking news alert. Breaking news from Detroit's west side, topping our show here at 4 o'clock. A home invasion turns deadly. You're taking a look at video that we shot from the scene. Priya Mann following the story since it did break. So what are you learning about this situation, Priya? Well, Karen, it has been a very busy afternoon for Detroit police. They're investigating multiple scenes right now. Here's where the home invasion took place on Detroit's west side, where a woman was targeted, her teen brother shot and killed. Meanwhile, the guys who broke in, they took off in a vehicle, crashed a few blocks away. That's where police are investigating a second scene, and that intruder was stabbed and found dead. Police say three men broke into a home on Santa Rosa and Margarita on Detroit's west side around one Monday afternoon. There were three people inside the home at the time. One of them was shot by the intruder and later died. Another person suffered a graze wound. Police say the people inside that home did put up a fight, stabbing one of the intruders in the neck. That's when the men who broke in took off in a car. That car crashed about three blocks away at Seven Mile in San Juan. When police got to the second scene, they found one person dead in the vehicle. He's believed to be the intruder who was stabbed by someone in the home. If you have any information about what happened here today, just give us a call. Do you think the other people in that vehicle took off on foot? Do you think there was a second vehicle involved? Are you looking for a second vehicle? We have no second vehicle involved in this incident at this time. We believe it was on foot. And this hour, police are looking for one person. They do have another in custody. This home invasion ends with two people dead. We'll have more at 5 o'clock. Reporting from Detroit's west side, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.